Hello and welcome to jasonnewland.com My name is Jason Newland This is Sleep Hypnosis Weekly I'm actually lying down on my bed, which is not something that I normally do. Well, it is something I do every day, but it's not something I normally do when I make a recording. For the simple fact that I often fall asleep. Because I associate lying down on the bed, and as I am, I'm lying on my my right side. This is my sleeping position, and I associate, you know, lying down on my, I say my right side, my left side, but I'm facing, yeah, it's a le- <coughs> I should know my left from my right. lying on my left side so how are you supposed to believe anything I say please remember to only listen to this when you can safely close your eyes (sighs) I kind of I feel that whatever I say during this recording, I'm just gonna just going to drift off to sleep. I do need to be awake in order to speak. It's one of those uh, things. So I thought maybe what I'd do is I'd go through what I will go through and describe to you how I'm feeling right now (sighs) this is lying here kind of cuddled up to my quilt my continental quilt and I've got my left leg underneath it and my right leg above it although I'm stretched out I'm not fully stretched out I'm kind of a little bit bent you know in the sense of uh, probably from my my back is straight ish but my hips and my knees are kind of I suppose in a, a cycling position if I was riding a bike but I want to ride a bike in bed 
plus, I don't know, I think riding pedal bikes is a bit too old for that these days. What I'm immediately noticing And it might be because I'm focusing on my legs as I was talking then. I'm noticing how relaxed my legs actually feel. There's a real comfort. It's almost as if they've just gone to sleep. It's like they're not waiting for my brain to switch off. They're not waiting for any kind of command or relaxation technique. It's as if my legs know that that when I lay down on the bed, it's time to relax and go to sleep. I can't imagine the same feelings with my hands as well. Very, very relaxed in my hands. Very, it's almost to a level of pleasure, like a comfortable pleasure of relaxation in my hands. Maybe that's because of the nerve endings in my fingers and because of how much I use my hands during the day. Just going around day to day Activities, moving my fingers around, picking items up, using the laptop, drinking my coffee, eating my dinner, using the remote control for the television, using my fingers and my hands to wash up, to wash my hands means I use my hands, so right now the last time I used my hands was when I pressed the record button to record my voice telling you about my hands and how they seem to have decided to just let go and sleep but not in that weird uh, feeling of when you kind of, you know, been lying on your arm or you've sat too long on the toilet and your leg goes to sleep and it's all tingly and uncomfortable. Not like that. It's a different kind of sleep. It's almost like I don't know, it almost feels like the parts of my body, it's like a big family. And they're all 
just going to bed. You know, all the kids are going to bed, my feet, my toes. They're all saying goodnight. See you in the morning. And they're just looking forward to relaxing. Because that's something that's, I think it's really underestimated. And overlooked in some ways. Because having studied relaxation and as well as having, I guess, been teaching it for 13 years. It seems to be something that we do during the day when we're awake. When in fact the easiest time to completely relax is when we're lying in your bed just lying here because the benefit is that you don't have to do anything Because I've, you know, in the past I've, I've actually led group relaxation sessions for about an hour. And the people get really relaxed, really deeply relaxed. But then the hour is over and they don't want to get up. They don't want to open their eyes and move on with the rest of their day they they want to stay relaxed and continue that feeling of pleasurable comfort that's filled their body and mind so the benefit of enjoying the opportunity of experiencing full relaxation throughout your entire body and mind. Now laying on your bed is that you don't have to finish the relaxation after an hour you can just allow that sense of relaxation to continue as long as it chooses and it's a nice feeling to feel unhurried it's a nice feeling to not have those time limitations knowing that you can lay here feeling relaxed for as long as you want and you know that eventually that relaxation 
will naturally become sleep. Naturally turn into that sensation of drifting into pleasant dreamy sensations where you're no longer conscious of your body nor concerned about anything and as I'm sure you know that the more relaxed your body continues to become causes your mind also to feel increasingly calm and to drift I can actually feel the relaxation of my eyes the pleasure in my eyes it feels really nice Comfort spread into my head, not just my brain and my mind, but also outside the scalp, my forehead, and again my eyes really noticing. the comfort and as I I notice 
yourself Drift I can feel my back It feels so loose All the muscles of my back Including my lower back My hips and my spine as I notice the back of my neck as my head is supported by the pillow almost as if the dreaming is starting just Pleasant images popping in and out of my mind.
เวทีอ๋อ